It's over. But this time we have the Lumen and Aegis Curio equipped. I'm gonna save the heck out of you, dude. Stop, come no further, or you too will be consumed by my blight. Not today. Oh wait, never mind. Or never, never mind. Oh god, do it again. What? Okay, that's that's a lot of that's a lot of oh my god, that's a lot of damage. Why do you have so much health? Am I supposed to win? Oh. That's a... Uh... Gotta love the title theme. Got him. Oh no! Become died. Wait, no, I'll use this. Did I miss? What's going on? I'm gonna get all the blade out of you. I'm gonna save the day forever and always. They're holding themselves back. They're letting us get the dub. Phase three. Dawn prayer. All of the other lilies are helping us. I think. It was as if I'd been in eternal sl a slumber. Unsure if I was alive or dead. The days were filled with nothing but pain. When I awoke, I lay on a black pedestal. I felt a warm touch grace me. The tiny white priestesses were holding my hands. The same priestesses who were made to take on my blight. From nearby, I could ma barely make out the voices of coven members. The blight transfer rite was about to begin. The priestesses, knowing nothing of their fate, nuzzled up to me. These children would be sacrificed to keep me alive. What was it all for? The time I spent with them was what truly saved me. If I am to pass on a legacy to these children, let it be one of hope, not suffering. But how? How is this happening? Could one white priestess alone have such power? No, that amulet. You made it whole again? All the fragments. All the shadows of our history, the unknowable suffering. You're going to bear it all from now on? I see. 
You came all this way with everyone. Thank you. For freeing us all. For freeing me. You accomplished what I couldn't. You were never just a clone of myself. You're your own person, Lily. You've grown so much. It's time. I should be going. I'll be watching over you. We'll always be together. Hopefully other people survived. It is done. At long last, for each, a proper burial. Lily, take heart, you are not alone. The Blight may have taken them, but they are still watching over us. And I will never leave your side. Ender Lilies, amidst a collapsed world, her words echoed out. Thank you for finding your way to me. I could be crazy, but if, I, if I'm not mistaken, this is actually a different start screen, too. Still love the, still love the main team. Still absolutely love the main team. There's a new game plus, too. Lost Heirloom allows the recollection of one's unblighted form. A hair ornament made from a pale flower received from the White Priestess of the Fount. After the Blight immobilized her, the Priestess of the Fount gifted these handmade or uh, ornaments as blessings to the other Priestesses in her stead. Achievement unlocked, Collector. So, same thing, but you look super cool the whole time? I, I'm kind of... You may now access Blightborn modes. Toggle these optional challenging modes to tailor your desired game experience. You may now access malign memories? Prepare for back-to-back -back battles against each previously purified boss whose memories you have viewed. I would never take this off. I like, I like it when we look all pristine and not in pain. That's pretty awesome, though. Oh, it even has timers on that. So much extra content and stuff. I like that there was actually a happy resolution and that the ancient warrior never left us. So it's kind of like we still have our family and they are all still watching over us and stuff. Game's super good. Game's super good. I like I like everything except for the... <gasps> in, in, in one of the soundtracks for the Abyss area, it's like the only thing I can think of. Like, the, the abilities feel good. Leveling them up feels good. The the dashing and like the, the mobility and everything, top notch. I really like Lily, I like the story, I like the locales. Like just a super, super, super good game. I like the healing. The only th also the only other thing though, I, I kinda wish levels up leveling up mattered more. We have two hundred and forty five attack right now, but it would normally be uh two hundred. From the very, very beginning of the game to absolutely max stats, you you only get four times damage. I'm like, I, I don't know, I'm like, I guess it's fine scaling, but I, I just wish leveling up felt more impactful. Either way, it's still fine. We got all the relics, we did all the things. Let me double check our quest log. We have all achievements now, yes? I didn't, I didn't screw anything up. Oh, it would be easier to check Steam. 38 of 38, yes. We have done all of the things. Ender Lilies has been 100% completed. There's other, like challenge mode stuff that we could do, but that's not for achievements and stuff. And so... We will retire it. It was a really, 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 really cool game. Really, really good Metroidvania. Super glad that we played it. Super glad, super glad for happy endings. I, I was really, really hoping that there would be something good working out. Like, there's usually a true ending, but I'm just like... Whenever, whenever there's like a bittersweet ending, I'm not about that. I, I need happiness. I need... I need these characters to, to, to have a happy ending when we're gone, because, like, once you beat a video game, that's it. Like, you don't see them again unless there's a sequel, and, like, if we're going to part, I, I want to know, I want to know that they're, they're, that they're happy. 
and that they're doing all right. I don't know, probably dumb, but either way. One last thing that I wanted to mention, when we hit level 100, and it's completely pointless, but uh, I grinded it to the point where we got really, really, really close to level 100, and then I grinded the enemies until I was like two experience away from leveling up, and then I went back to the very, very first slug enemy that we ever encountered into the game, and I killed that to get level 100. There was no reason for me to do that, and it would wasted a lot of time, but, uh... We did hit level 100 off of the very first enemy in the game. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you liked it. Later, everybody.